In an era where people are more concerned about the number of pixels on their screen than the number of hours they've slept, it's refreshing to take a step back and appreciate the finer things in life. Today's world is obsessed with high-end graphics and eye-catching user interfaces. It's a race, a competition to own the latest flashiest gaming consoles or the most powerful PCs. All this just to brag about possessing the best graphics. But let's pause for a moment and ask ourselves, is the measure of our enjoyment really dependent on how realistic the water looks in a video game or how smoothly the windows minimize on our desktop? It seems we've been caught up in this whirlwind of technological advancement and forgotten the beauty of simplicity. This brings us to our topic for today, a comparison between the modern windows and the classic MS-DOS. But hey, who needs a million colors when you have MS-DOS's glorious monochrome? Now let's take a moment to appreciate the undeniable superiority of MS-DOS. In a world where we're constantly bombarded with flashy interfaces and endless updates, the simplicity of MS-DOS is truly a breath of fresh air. With MS-DOS, you're not wasting precious seconds waiting for fancy icons to load. You're not stuck twiddling your thumbs while your system updates for the umpteenth time. No, with MS-DOS, you input your command, and boom, you're off to the races. MS-DOS is the epitome of productivity, efficiency, and speed. It's like the Olympic sprinter of operating systems, while Windows is more like your clumsy cousin who trips over his own feet. And let's not forget about the gaming. Oh, the gaming. Long before Windows was even a glimmer in Bill Gates' eye, Mississippi, DOS was the platform for legendary games. Prince of Persia, Doom, Wolfenstein 3D, these are the titles that shape the future of gaming. These are the games that made us fall in love with the virtual world, long before the days of VR headsets and motion sensors. Windows, on the other hand, is just now catching up with its game library. Sure, it's got some big names, but most of them are just rehashed versions of the classics. And let's not even talk about the crashes. There's nothing quite like being in the middle of an intense gaming session only to have your computer freeze up on you. Ah, the joys of modern technology. But with MS-DOS, you don't have to worry about any of that. It's just you, your keyboard, and the sweet, sweet sound of 8-bit music playing in the background. Sure, Windows might have Fortnite, but MS-DOS has the original Oregon Trail. I know which one I'd prefer. So let's all take a moment to appreciate the beauty of MS-DOS. It may not have the glitz and glamour of its modern counterparts, but it's got something far more important. Reliability, efficiency, and a whole lot of nostalgia. Now that we've established that MS-DOS is the superior operating system, what can we do to embrace this obsolete tech? Well, glad you asked. There are numerous ways to incorporate MS-DOS into your daily life. For starters, it's a terrific platform for programming. With MS-DOS, you're working at the foundation of computing, where you can truly understand what's going on beneath the hood of your machine. It's like building a car from scratch, instead of just driving one off the lot. And let's not forget about file management. With MS-DOS, you're in the driver's seat, not some automated system that decides where to stash your files. You command, it follows. No more searching through endless folders and subfolders for that one file you downloaded three months ago. Everything is right where you left it, because you're the one who put it there. Even if you're not a programmer or a file management enthusiast, Mississippi. DOS can still find a place in your life. Ever heard of nostalgia? Yes, that warm fuzzy feeling of yesteryears. Playing classic games like Prince of Persia, Space Invaders, or Pac-Man on MS-DOS is like a trip down memory lane, offering a sense of simplicity and charm that today's high-definition, overly complicated games just can't match. And remember, you're not alone in this journey to embrace the obsolete. There's a whole community of MS-DOS enthusiasts affectionately known as DOS heads, who are still using and developing for the system. They're a tight-knit group, always ready to share tips, tricks, and a few laughs about the good old days. So next time you're cursing at your computer for yet another Windows update, just remember, you could be living the simple life with MS-DOS. But no, you chose chaos.